So now it is confession time for me. Now, as I said at the beginning, I will be revealing my biggest failure when it comes to resolution. So maybe you actually have a resolution or goal that you have been making every single year and year after year, you always seem to fail. Maybe you start off well and then you just, it just seems to just go wrong completely and then you end up feeling really bad about yourself and part of you thinks well should I just take this resolution off my list and just forget about it because it's just making me feel bad there are maybe certain goals that aren't really that important and you just have it there for the sake of it and if you if you find yourself keep uh, not doing it and it's not that important to you then just take it off your list but if it's something that is actually going to help you it's something good it's something that will will, will open doors for, for other things then I think you should stick to it. Now my biggest failure when it comes to resolutions is learning a language and that has been Portuguese and would you believe it I've been putting this on my list probably for about 15 years I know it's really shameful to say and um, I, I, I sort of start off I start learning I start um, putting time aside and then you know how it is the business of life just comes and it's like oh my god I can't fit it in anymore and that's been my story for years and years and the reason I want to learn Portuguese is not because um, you know it's just a hobby, it's actually useful for some of the things that I'm doing. So I do have a very good reason to, to learn Portuguese. But what I had to actually do and what I started to do at the end of last year, instead of trying to put time aside and you know that extra study time, getting apps, all these things I've tried. I've tried the apps, I've tried putting time aside, I've tried being accountable to people. There was once I actually sent an email to all of my Portuguese friends and I said to them from now on, I'm only going to speak Portuguese, I only want you to speak Portuguese to me and no, nothing else, don't speak to me in English. How long did that last? Not long. So it was like I tried all of the normal things that we say about sticking to resolutions, none of that was working. So, but what I did last, started to do last year, I incorporated learning this language into what I already do. So for example, um, anytime that I'm cleaning, for example, anytime that I'm ironing, I will put on a video in Portuguese and watch that. And even though I, I don't understand everything, but I found that each time I listened, I, I watched something or I listened to something in Portuguese, I'm starting to pick up new words. And there was a time that I watched almost the whole video and I, I understood like maybe 90% of it. So that's the way that I have found to actually uh, learn, actually start d sticking to this resolution. Even though I started at the end of last year, look, I had the whole year, had the whole of 2017 trying to learn. And it was only, and I, I, again, I started to feel bad about myself. I still haven't done it after all this time. Then for some reason, this thing just said, just, just watch, just watch videos. And then, you know, then I started, it was, as I said, it was at the end of last year, but it started to help. And now I actually feel quite excited to, as soon as I'm going to put on a vid, I'm like, yes, let's see how much I'm going to understand this time. So even though I'm not speaking much at the moment, but the fact is I'm trying to get the, the listening and trying to understand everything first. So that's working for me. So maybe again, as I said, maybe you have a goal, you have this, this thing that you have been trying to do. And like I said, if it's something that's not going to, not really important, it's not going to benefit you, just let it go. Oh, maybe it's not that important to you you have to really want to do something for a reason but if it's something that you just haven't managed to do for some reason and it's bugging you and you really want to get it done try to find a way of actually incorporating it into your life in a different way you might not be able to do it the way that I've suggested or the way I've done this with a language but just sit down and think of different ways how can I actually put this into practice um, all the things that have stopped me from doing this before, what, what else can I do? Have a good think because sometimes there's something right in front of you that maybe you've, you know, because you, you haven't taken the time to think about it, you've not noticed, but maybe there's something there that you can incorporate immediately that will help you to actually achieve that goal.